Let me put the stairwell down so y'all can um see me. Uh -uh. Well, I guess that didn't make a difference. Or whatever, but um I gotta find my little chapstick because my lips and stuff are all dry. Oh y'all look at my little um emoji. <laughs> Cheese. Don't be judging me. Let me turn this camera. What's going on, you guys? It's your boy, Sheik, and I'm back with another video. But right now, my lips and stuff it is kind of dry, so I'm using this Chromix. Y'all can see it. Chromix. I'm back with another video to tell y'all about the story time of um, me getting in an accident and why I ended up in the hospital for several, several long days. Let's get into this. <laughs> let's get into that. Let's get into this. Let's get into that. You know, let's go ahead and get with this video. Let's go ahead and get with this video. It was November the 13th around 12 o'clock. But before that, I went to work and I was feeling great. You know, being me, being myself. Working, 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 and working, and working. Like I said again, I was feeling fine. Y'all need to keep count of how many times I say feeling fine and put it in the comments. But anyway, I was feeling fine at work. It was going on 12. This was the day of my aunt's funeral. So I was going to get off early, which I did get off early. Around that time as me getting off of work. Well, before I even got off of work. Um, let's move on. <laughs> okay, stay up there. I was kind of feeling kind of woozy you know kind of feeling a little bad all of a sudden i would feel fine five minutes later i'm feeling bad so at that moment you know it was time for me to get off so i started feeling fine again and i sat in the parking lot for about an hour or so at my job before i started driving or whatever and What else happened? I started coming home. I got like down the road from my house. And all I noticed is my eyes just said, Shoo. and all I could see was white. So I kind of went out. By the time I came back, when I looked in front of me, I seen bushes. Boom. That's all I remember. I went out, I can hear out of my ears. My eyes was like closed shut. Yes, I had my seatbelt on, I had my seatbelt on. No, it ain't in this car, but I had my seatbelt on and I could just feel the car like boom, 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 boom. And I could hear it, I could hear the grass, grass. I could hear the glass cracking in the car. So my car had to flip seven times so um i could take you off because i'm not going to work but anyway i was just about to pull in i was about five couple minutes i say about five minutes away from home for me turning in to come home to change my clothes so i can go to my funeral but november 13th i did not make it to her funeral the car was flipped upside down i noticed i was flipped upside down because the way i felt in the car and so i i sat there for about five minutes before i hit the seat belt and i noticed i'm like boom i hit the top of the roof that's how i knew i was upside down because i came from the seat hit this part of the roof and it was over so by the time i tried to get out i noticed i felt like a pool and i'm still trying to tussle to get out of this car I got glass and stuff all in my mouth. My cheeks was out. But, um, glad I didn't swallow because if I would have swallowed, I would have had glass cut me all through here. So, in the meantime of me trying to get out the car, I had this seat belt hung around my throat. So, I could not breathe. I got I was like, oh my God. So, in the meantime, I did get out. So, I finally got out the car and I noticed, like, I'm just out of my mind. I'm like, who car is this? And why this car flipped upside down? Where is my car? 
So I came back to my senses and I'm like, did I hit somebody? Did a long distance truck hit me? So the people across the street, they was screaming like, what happened? What, what? I'm, I'm just saying to myself, what happened? Y'all need to tell me what happened so I can call the police. To report this so the man that was across the street he was like um son you flipped your car all i know this your car was swerving and you boom 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 and i'm like are you serious right now what happened so around that time he was like you need to call somebody is there anybody else in the car i'm like no that was like have you been drinking no i just got off work that was like were you sleepy no, I don't know what's going on. All I know is I was kind of feeling bad. I'm really feeling sick to the stomach. I'm feeling so bad. It was like an off and on sickness that was like really beating me up on the inside. Like they kept asking me, is there anybody in the car? I don't say no. And it was like, are you okay? I was like, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. So in the meantime, I was like, that was like, where are your phone? Um, I guess it's in the car. The car is flipped over. I can't go over there and get it. I will be showing y'all pictures of my car through the clips. My bad, y'all. In the process of me recording, my phone died. So, um, let me get back in the car and I'll finish this video. I don't even know where I left off at, but anyway, we had called the ambulance to come to pick me up because I'm sitting over here like, I wonder if I hit a dog or if a damn truck hit me. I'm trying to figure some stuff out. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm kind of nervous and shit. So I end up calling my mom and I'm like, Ma, I got in a car accident. You're going to be mad because I flipped this car over. So my mom came out there to check up on me, see how I was doing. But in the meantime, so we had to end up calling the paramedics because I wanted to go home and just lay down. So in the meantime, of me getting to the hospital, they did all these tests on me, figure out what was going on. They did a brain test. I'll be posting that picture up. So y'all can see the little sticky things all on my head. I'm in there for hours and hours and hours. And it was like, we're going to have to send you to one of the hospital. I'm like, why? So they sent me over to one of the hospital because they was telling me, before they sent me to the hospital, after they did the, um, the MRI on my lungs and did a CT scan from my brain or whatever, to figure out what was going on. Like, what made you pass out over this wheel? Come to find out, y'all, I had walking pneumonia. Walking pneumonia. So, walking pneumonia will sneak up on you at any time. And it, and it don't tell you what you need to know. Like, it don't... I didn't have no symptoms. All I noticed is I was just feeling bad. I just felt like I didn't eat nothing all day. So, went to the other hospital, did all that, as y'all seen in the other video, me doing all these tests and stuff. So, that is what happened. I had pneumonia, come to find out when they did my um, CT scan on my brain, come to find out I had a little bit of fluid on my brain. I had to do that lumbar puncture thing from the back to drain the fluid from off the top of my head. From my spine and everything so that is what happened and that is how i flipped my other car over so now i got a brand new car but um if you guys new to this channel make sure um you go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you want to hear my full times <laughs> hit the subscribe button hit the like button comment okay comment if you got any questions about me doing a hospital visit just comment okay but make sure you guys subscribe, okay? That's the end of that video. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my bad. But before I go, y'all, check out my um my Garfield. It's, it's nice. Um, I got it for a Christmas present. I don't know where my co-worker got it from, but it's nice. I like it. It needs to be washed. But anyway, like I said again, if you're new to my channel, make sure you guys go ahead and smash the subscribe button. Make sure you join the team as of Sheet TV. I will be back with more videos. And um, Valentine's Day is around the corner, which is the 14th. Okay, so you guys um just might be seeing a video of me on Valentine's Day. Just... <laughs>
just being myself but make sure you guys do not miss out on any videos that i will be posting i know i don't post like that but i'm trying to get this thing going up trying to get this thing going up but like i said again make sure you go ahead and tap that subscribe button that's sliding across that screen as of right now before you go and watch any more videos but until then i love you guys but god I love you more peace